I know that according to non-duality, the person is not the doer and it's not in control. Yet I feel a lot of resistance to a situation. And I strongly prefer the situation to be different. There are other people involved and, of course, the person cannot change anything, let alone choices and preferences of others. In fact, the person is happening without free will. So also my resistance to this situation is happening. I feel like an energy is blocked by my resistance. It feels so silly to ask what I can do. But do you have any suggestions for the poor person? There is frustration here. Yes, so I have some advice. So, first of all, the reason that you're suffering is because there is identification with the thoughts and feelings come along, coming up. So I'm just going to invent what that person's done, so the, because I just make things up to to try and talk about this. So I'm just going to make up that they've been an asshole. So say they've been an asshole, and then. What happens in you is there is pain to that. So there's pain in the heart. And then if you go deeply into that feeling, maybe you feel abandoned by their actions and maybe you feel afraid of their actions. So maybe that's in the heart and then that's also in the um, sacral chakra. So in the heart and in the sacral chakra. And these feelings appear and there is identification with those feelings. So your person wants to get rid of them. So your person is seeking to try to get a better experience. It can't bear having those feelings. So rather than letting the darkness there, it thinks that there's something wrong with it and it needs to get to something else. And by doing that and having done that for like 20, 30 years, I don't know how old you are, Monique, what you've done is the feelings become elongated in the body. So it's drawn out a, mo a lot longer by the resistance to it. And you can't have done anything differently. You couldn't have um, not tried to resist them. It's just part of the setup of the person. What I suggest for that person to do, but know that this too isn't prescription, this is a description, of what can happen is to put attention into the feelings and to get to know the feelings. Also do something like Osho breathing meditation, like something physical to help try to get them out of the body. And then also the most obvious thing is to see that whatever you're thinking or feeling towards this person isn't truth. I'm not suggesting that you don't put up boundaries, but after you've asserted the boundaries, you don't need to speak to them more. Or you don't need to speak to yourself more about it. You don't need to have internal dialogue. So the reason it's happening is because there is identification there. And a habit as well. So that would be my advice. For you. <laughs>